Indiana officials announced today that the state's surplus has reached a new record, $6.1 billion, and some are pushing for another check to provide inflation relief. Fox 59 State House reporter Kristen Escal joins us live in studio after getting reaction from lawmakers. Kristen? Well, Dan, Indiana lawmakers will be back at the State House in 10 days to work on an inflation relief package. The proposal put forward by Governor Eric Holcomb a few weeks ago would give each Hoosier taxpayer $225. But some lawmakers argue the state should give back more money. Indiana's surplus now topping $6 billion. Auditor Tara Klotz called it historic. It's no surprise that Indiana collected significantly more revenue than we anticipated. Lawmakers will soon discuss Governor Eric Holcomb's inflation relief plan, which gives a $225 refund to all Hoosier taxpayers. It would return $1 billion total. But some lawmakers argue the state should give more money back. Democratic State Senator Fatty Cadora has proposed increasing the refund to $400 per taxpayer and targeting Hoosiers who make less than $75,000 each. We want to double the amount, but also structure it in a way that it goes towards families that need it the most. Cadora and other lawmakers also want to include Hoosiers who are on Social Security or disability and don't file tax returns. None filers have already paid their taxes over decades working for the state of Indiana. And because of their hard work, their tax dollars contributed to the surplus that we had for a decade. Office of Management and Budget Director Chris Johnston says it's unclear how many more people would get a tax refund under that plan. We would have to take that billion dollars and probably do some sort of calculation to set aside that money for the people that aren't defined. Republican legislative leaders declined to speak with us on camera about the surplus. Indiana Senate President Pro Tem Roderick Bray released a statement leaving the door open to other options for inflation relief. He said in part, quote, as we look toward the special session, Senate Republicans are considering a package that can provide relief to Hoosiers in multiple ways while continuing to pay down our outstanding debt. Governor Eric Holcomb said earlier this week he's open to discussing changes to his inflation relief proposal. After today's announcement, he sent us a statement saying in next year's budget, he wants to see the state surplus used to increase funding for schools, public health, and economic development grants. Kristen Escal, Fox 59 News. All right, Kristen, thank you so much.